Big Way World Tour 2012-2013 Season Awards. Event one of the BWWT kicks off with the Quicksilver Ceremonial in Punta de Lobos, Chile. Although lack of swell caused the 2012 event to be canceled, event organizers are already in full preparation for this year's Quicksilver Ceremonial. The waiting period begins April 15, 2013. Peru came to life for event number two on August 14th as the Bilbao Pro Pico Alto ran in solid 10 to 15 foot swell. Carlos Burley was crowned the champion, Greg Long coming in second, and the race for the Big Wave World title was on. The ocean came alive once again on January 20th, 2013 for the Mavericks Invitational. One of the cleanest days on record with the deep ocean swell provided for an incredible event. After years of dedication, Peter Mel captured his first Mavericks championship, while once again, Greg Long made it to the final. A new venue for the Big Wave World Tour saw an incredible qualifying event held at Punta Galea, Basque Country. The young guard charged the 17-year-old Nacho Gonzalez proved to be more than qualified in taking first place. Punta Galea has a great future with the tour with some incredible talent coming out of the area and waves to match. The swells continued to churn during the early months of 2013 and a late season clean one approached the North Pacific. Only days after Punta Galea, the tour set course for Nelscott Reef, Oregon at the fourth event of the season. Jamie Sterling was crowned the winner with once again Greg Long to the final. The Big Wave World Tour season came to an intense conclusion in the early weeks of February 2013 as the Pacific swells began to slow down somewhat early. Greg Long is crowned the champion of the 2012-2013 Big Wave World Tour, making every final while never placing lower than third place. His dedication, preparation, and passion culminated in his wearing the crown. 